Cece. Know what? Louis asked me for help in Miss Nelson's algebra class. No way. He's the one you wanted to go to the dance with, right? Yes, I think he's not that great with numbers, which is perfect, because maybe I'll get to help him again. You're so lucky. I know, but the problem is... What? I don't know how I behave around him. What if I do really weird faces or smell bad or something without even knowing? You know you will. Remember that one time your underwear fell out of your gym bag? <laughs> <laughs> no, but really, I'm serious. When I'm around him, I forget everything else. All I see and think about is Louie, Louie, Louie. It's ridiculous. Can you at least remember the math? Duh, everything but math then. I have an idea. I can be your love spy. My what? Your love spy. While you focus on Louie, I focus on you. And then I report back to tell you if you blush, giggle, and also how Louie's looking at you. That's the best idea I've ever heard. But if you give me away, I'll kill you. I know you will. So you know I won't. My observations are, blushing, no. Fidgeting, yes. Overtly adoring stare, not sure. Excessive smiling, perhaps. Overall score, doing okay. Whew! I know, right? What about Louie, though? Oh. What? Well, I kind of focused on you. The whole class? Yeah, but no worries. We have math tomorrow as well. I'll focus on him then. You'd better. Ah, uh, come on. You should thank me. Being a love spy is one fun but ungrateful job. I'm sure Cece is crushing hard on Mel. You think? Yeah. Why? Cece was just like staring at Mel all through Miss Nelson's class. He didn't take her eyes off of her even for a second. <laughs> Can I get a quarter of double shot chocolatino with a sugar-free watermelon shot to go, please? CC staring at Mel, huh? Sounds kinda obsessed. Just water, please. Know who also is obsessed? <laughs> you? No, Mel. And guess who she's obsessed with? You? No, you. Oh, no. You sure? Yeah. What should I do? Flirt back, maybe? Don't you want to take her to the dance? Don't you want to date her, love her, and have many Mel's and many Louis and spend eternity with her forever and ever? And ever? No. Why not? You know, I like her, but I don't like her like her. That's a lot of likes for someone you don't like like. I've known her for so long. She's like a sister. If she like likes me, it'd be weird. If so, there's only one thing to do. What? Gross her out. What? Yeah, pick your nose, scratch your butt, chew with your mouth open, that kind of stuff. It really works. My cousin's friend did it, and now he has no problem with girls. Do I have to? Of course not, but it's the only way to shake off Mel. Is there no other way? Cece's gonna notice as well. Her and Mel are always hanging out together. And Cece smells so good. There is one other way. Ignore Mel, but it might backfire. My cousin's friend tried ignoring first, but it backfired. The girls fought harder and harder to get his attention. It got out of hand. They started hanging around his house, looking through his window, and calling him all the time. Ugh. I know, so gross. On one condition. What? You go gross with me. Sure, I'm a natural grocer. I can't believe I got a D in biology. I can't believe I got a B minus. Really? What? To complain you got a B when I got a D. I can't complain? I've aced all my tests. There is no reason whatsoever that I shouldn't get an A. Yeah, but still.
You know what your problem is? You think you're so different from everyone else and that just being you will give you good grades. You know what your problem is? You have no life and no friends. If having a life is like having friends like yours, then I'll pass. And you know mom will consider my B a D and your D a B. No, she won't. Yes, she will, and you know it. Whatever. What's up? Why are you two so miserable? Oliver got a D in biology. That's great, Ollie. You passed. Yeah, and Eden got a B minus. Really? Didn't you ace all your tests? What happened? Did you miss handing in an assignment or something? See? What did I say? I got my period last week. Lucky you. I got it when I was nine. Well, I've had it for ages, too. Yeah, I think all the girls in our class have gotten it by now. Not Cece, though. Right, Mel? Not sure. Thanks for covering for me. What? Back in the bathroom. I heard you guys. What's it like, though? What's what like? Periods. Aunt Flo. Shark week. It's annoying. I get cramps. But you can get out of gym, though. Huh? I wish I had that excuse. What if there's something wrong with me? Don't worry about it. That's easy for you to say. I have a plan, though. Really? What plan? I hope you don't want me to become your blood spy. No, you'll see. I think I might get it soon. Yeah? Yeah, I'm so ready. I have everything prepared. I even have both chocolate and anchovies and a really sad playlist in case I get that sad feeling you've said you get. Sure. I know you all complain about it, but I can't think of anything real bad with it. You have a valid excuse to just eat snacks and watch sad movies. I mean, really, what's so bad about it? Except that I'll have it for like, 30 years. It sucks when you're in a really bad mood and people ask if it's that, that time of the month, month, and it is. I can't wait till that happens to me. Oh, hey, Eden. That's so cool. Your Finsta is the most popular account around. You're looking great. Have you been working out? I didn't know you had so many followers. Want to grab a coffee sometime? I think they all want to get selfies with you. People, people, calm down. There's plenty of Eden to go around. I declare Eden king of the dance. Three cheers for the king. Hip, hip, hurrah. Hip, hip, hurrah. Hip, hip, hurrah. Mm. I started a finster for Kinu. Yeah? What's the name of it? Simply Kinu. Just Kinu? No, simply Kinu. Two words. Simply, then Kinu. Okay, so simply Kinu. Yeah. So what do you post there? Simply Kinu. It's just pics of him. It's all Kinu all the time. I feel kind of bad for him. He hasn't gotten any followers. He doesn't care. He's a dog. Still, 
He could be a dog influencer, make tons of money, and you'd never have to work a day in your life. <laughs> You're obsessed. Not everything's about how many likes you get, and I don't have to work as it is. Whatever. I'll follow Kinu from both my Rinsta and my Finsta. That will double his followers. You're welcome. Ah, uh, yeah, your Finsta. How's that going? Oh, slow and steady, but it's my Finsta. It's just for me. Oh, rats, my Finsta is blowing up. I thought that's what you always wanted. Not like this, look. Whoa, it really did. Who'd have thought your sad rant about croissants would do that? It's an ode to croissants. It's epic. So many comments, too. Cece the Moon says, your poems are yummy. Croissant slay. Wait, what? Who's Zadtar7362? I don't know. What should I do? Should I delete it or embrace it? Oh, wait. I know. We should use it to help Kinu. You write a sad poem about croissants and dogs and have Kinu read it. My poems are not that sad. They are kind of sad, but you're proof that sad can work. You're never doughy and never stale. My love for you is beyond the pale. We'll meet at lunchtime, my flaky friend. To me, you're delicious. For you, I'm the end. Hi, Louis. Eden, what do you think? Hi, Eden. I saw you wearing this the other day and asked mom if I could have, I could one, have too. one too. <sighs> you could have asked. I knew you wouldn't mind though. Never mind. Let's get practicing. We don't have much time to the dance and we want to look good. Sure, I'm just going to take this off. Don't want to mess this puppy up. Always with the clothes. They're just things, man. Try not to worry about them. Let's get going. Nice one. <sighs> Let's get out of here. I need a drink. I have not sweated this much since bring your son to work day. I need this. This very berry cherry banana smoothie. So, so beautiful. beautiful. Only, Only I understand, I understand you. you. Don't look at Don't me like that. Like that. Honestly, Honestly, I just like, just how, like how CC smells. smells. Nothing, more. Nothing more. Uh, just tap water, please. <laughs> That's better. Oh no, quick, quick, lend me your sweater. No, I, I... Ah, oh, come on, it's just a sweater. Quick, Cece's almost here. But, but... Thanks, made it. Nice hoodie, Louie. Oh, yeah, it's new. Cool patterns, right? Yeah, never seen anything like it. What kind of fashion tech is that? It's hypnotic. The shapes, I can taste time, smell the future. It all makes sense. Oh, right, it's... Smoothie smooth tech. Smoothie smooth. Fascinating. You always know what's in. They're just things, man. Things, man. Hi, Eden. <sighs> what's wrong with him? Some people just can't handle the sensory overload. He's probably overheated. He's a bit sensitive. I got the stain out, but it took forever. You're never wearing my stuff again. Get your own smoothie smooth gear. It's just a sweater. I worked really, really hard for it. There's no such thing as just a sweater. Agree to disagree. Is your sister home? Sophia? I don't know. Why? You know why. I'm afraid of her, like most people. You want us to tell you about Sophia? Sophia's like really pretty. She always color coordinates her shoes with her hair color. It's like Sophia's got laser vision. Zooming in on your weaknesses. She says stuff about other people that makes everyone laugh, but when she says something about yourself, it sucks. Once she asked if I had back pain because my glasses looked so heavy. Also her clothes. It doesn't matter what she wears, everything looks amazing on her. And she asked Kika if they could lower their electricity bill since their hair is always so static. What do you say back to that? You just stand around feeling stupid. Sophia, what can I say? Sophia's command of the English language is impressive, especially for someone her age. She can spell ca ca cacophonous just like that. Not easy. Bravo, Sophia. If she says she wants to hang out, you'll cancel whatever plans you have, even with your best friends. Everybody does it. I never do that to you. Yeah, you would. Yeah, maybe. You're right. I 
Ew. She's not just like that. It's different at home. Yeah? How so? With Sophia at home, she can be a bit of a slob. You want to see her room? And boy, can she talk back. But she can also be really sweet when she wants to. She's Mr. Bacon's favorite. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. Meow. I love her. We have movie marathons in her room, and we laugh at all the same jokes. And she lets me borrow some of her clothes. At least the ones that don't fit her anymore. Yeah, I'm still afraid of her. Don't be. Know that green jumpsuit I showed you? She grew out of it. It would look amazing on you. For when? For the dance, of course. You think she'd let me? Maybe if you knew her better. Let's go back to my place. See if she's home. Huh. <sighs> Boring homework? Done. Free afternoon? Come to me! Yes! We can do anything! Who could that be? <gasps> Hi, Mom. You want me to dog sit Louie's dog, Kinu? I really can. I've got loads of homework. It's not an excuse. You promised Louie's mom? Could you have at least check with me first? I have a life too, you know. I have to head over to Louie's. Mom ordered me to dog sit Kinu. What? This is a perfect research opportunity for your love spy. Thanks for this. Kinu doesn't really have the energy to go anywhere these days. Just remember to give him his special food. See ya. I feel odd about being here. I should love it surrounded by Louie, but I just feel awkward. Yeah, yeah. So what you want to do? Watch something? I guess. But let's snoop around first. See if we can get to know Louie a bit better. Really? What do we have here? Who knew Louie kept a journal? Put that down. That's personal. Read it, Mel. What could possibly be wrong with that? I actually agree with her. I want to know what makes Louie tick. I thought you were supposed to be the good one? Yeah. No, we can't. It's immoral. We're better than that. What if there's something about you in there? Uh, you're right, though. Let's forget we ever saw it. Check that he hasn't placed a hair on top of it. We'll have to make sure to put it back. No hair. It's safe. It's so dull. Listen to this. Saturday. Today was so good. I got up, had breakfast, took Kinu for a walk, posted about Kinu, and went to bed. Perfect day. Snore! It does sound like a good day, though. Uneventful, but good. Oh, stop it. You have your love goggles on. Here's something. I'm so scared that Kinu will die. What, what if the special, special food, food doesn't, doesn't work? work? I hope he makes it to the end of the school year. If he doesn't, there's no way I won't cry in class. He's so sensitive. A true animal lover. Yeah, I guess. But it says something else, too. What? Mel, if you're reading this, I want you to know that I love you. Let me see that. See? Wow, it's true. I was sure you were teasing me. This feels amazing. Oh, wait, no. I'm sorry, Mel. This was actually written last Friday, and last Friday was opposite day, if you remember. Oh, no, you're right. Wait a sec. What's that noise? <gasps> Kinu! Mel! Kinu looks so ill! We need to call Louie and tell him to get home. What if his dog dies Die. while we're dog-sitting him? Did you feed him his special food? No, I didn't. Stay away from the lake, Kinu! You call Louie. I... I just can't. It's really weird if I call him. You've known him all your life. Exactly, and I'm crushing on him. For you, he's just some guy. Okay, I'll do it, but on one condition. What is it? Two conditions, actually. Spit it out, I'll do anything. First condition is, we should call Eden here too. He always knows what to do. Okay, then my conditions say you have to call Eden also. I call the conditions here. The second condition is, you tell those girls I got my period. You're going to make me lie? when a dog's life is at stake. You call Louie and Eden then, but you better be quick. Looks like time's running out for Kinu. Tick, 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 talk, talk, tick, tick, talk, talk. No, 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 you do it. I agree with your stupid conditions. Can you make that thing go any faster? Oh, it's old school. It does look good though. I wish I could have one. Well, Mel, 
You can too! It's available as a part of the Vintage Furniture Pack, which includes 49 charming pieces of furniture. That sounds great, Cece! With its four floor patterns and five wall decorations, I'd say the Vintage Furniture Pack adds a touch of class to any social occasion. Hello, Louie. Kino is dying! Get back here! So why were you so worried about Kinu? He seems fine. He looked really ill. We thought perhaps he was dying. Uh, don't worry about it. He's just old, especially in dog years. Converted from human years, he's nearly 382. More like 68, but whatever. Well, now that we're all here, let's do something. Sorry, not feeling it. I just want to chill with Kinu for a bit, celebrate that he's fine. Come on, we could watch something. No. Eat something? Nah. Take Kino for a stroll. Uh, Bake? Uh. Play a game? No. Come on, Louie. You're such a drag. You say no to everything. No, I don't. OK, I have an idea. What? Prove you could say yes by agreeing to do everything we tell you have to dance. No. See? OK, I'll do it. I'll say yes to everything you ask at the dance. Oh, we are going to have a lot of fun with this. Yes. <laughs> I imagine we are going to get into all kinds of hilarious situations. <laughs> I can't believe I agreed to say yes to everything you tell me to do at the dance. Me neither. But you did! And now, the fun begins. Change the music. Dance with Miss Nelson. Burp! <clears throat> Juggle. Don't blink for a minute. We get Jenna. Eat an egg in an inventive way. <laughs> Post a selfie. Shake hands with him. Play the bongos. Tell a joke. Play the spoons. Do a magic trick. Lose yourself in the moment. Tell the moon a secret. Help someone. Blow a big bubble. Blank Sophia. Talk to your reflection. Prepare a salad. Speak in riddles. Invent a new color. Go gross. Love spy. <sighs> Kiss Mel. On the oh, lips. lips. Uh... Oh, I got a good one. Go into the main school computer and change my brother's grades. Eden. Well, will you, Louie? Hello, welcome to the school computer -y system. How can I help? Huh, our school's kind of high tech. Huh? I'd like to improve Eden's brother Ali's grades. Please, Mr. School Computer System. Grade modified. I require your password to make a final change. Uh, any ideas? I require your password. Uh. Uh. Unauthorized access detected. Photo submitted. This incident has been reported. And detention assigned. No! no! Yes! What? I take this seriously. Today, I say yes to everything. You went from negative Louie to positive Louie in less than a day? Yes! It's too weird. I don't know you anymore. Please return to your old at least sometimes negative self. I agree. But before you go back to saying no to everything again, will you dance with me? Sure. And with me? And me?
Don't forget to subscribe. And oh, you can download Toka Life World for free today.